hey guys welcome back glad you can join me if you're watching so i just wanted to come back with a little updated video i have definitely not um come back since the last one with any updates but here's the outside of my boutique i got my uh i think that's called decals i don't know what it's called the thing on the door i got that done by my neighbors down there i'm gonna show you their Here's one of my neighbors. She's a hair salon. So you can see. And this is who did my door. My neighbors are awesome, by the way. So he did my door. Let me get a close up. He did my door. Um, when I went to him, you know, letting him know that it, I had a certain time frame of when I wanted it completed, uh, he was like, well, you know it's not gonna be done no time soon and how about that same night it was on my door so this is the inside now I'm not done I'm still in the process of decorating and filling up my shelves oh last video I had up y'all remember that I was priming my floors well that was a no the paint was coming up and it was just a hot mess so let me just do a little tour that's the other window i try to do some decorating i thought it was, i think it's pretty cute you know you know a little bougie or whatever um this is where i put my final product i need to um steam my tablecloths but anyway this is where i put my final products after they're packaged and shrink wrapped. Um, I don't know if that's where I want them to stay, but that is where they are for right now. These are the ones that I haven't shrink wrapped yet. Um, these are the products that are curing in the back. Oh, and I made these shelves. I know I was talking about making some shelves. I don't remember if I had shelves in the in the background, but I got went to Lowe's, got me some plywood, gave them my measurements. And one of my friends let me borrow their, um, one of my friends that let me borrow their drill. And these flowers and those flowers over there that I have on the wood. Sorry. Flowers that I have on the wood. I got those from Amazon. And I just stapled them up there. Some of the decorations I got was from the dollar store, Dollar Tree. Anywhere I seen something cute. And I just put for right now, um, I went, so I think it was Walmart and I got some tablecloths and put that baby right up there. These shelves I got from Amazon, they were like $30, but it definitely was not worth it because the amount of time and energy I had to put in to try to put them things together. And my flower wall, I got those from Amazon. A little money tree. I think that's so cute. But like I said, I'm not done. Those, oh, those lights, I got them. Let me turn off the light so you can see. Let me see. Oh, they so pretty. <laughs> I got those from Amazon. It is so pretty at nighttime. I haven't been turning them on, but I turned them on today. So I'm slowly working on different products, trying to fill my shelves. As you can see, quite a few are empty, but you know, it's temporary. It's temporary, my darling. This is right now where I package my stuff. So I wanted to go in the back, but I like the um, I like the scenery. You know, I don't like to be caged in. Oh, I got butterflies on my wall. So okay. I had about a hundred butterflies on these walls from over here to a little over there, some over there, and a bunch over there. And they did not stick. I got those from Amazon too. They did not stick. So I gotta figure out something else to put up there. I got this camera, but I don't know how to zoom. <laughs> there we go. There we go. 
Is this my packaging? I don't know if I want to keep that. I mean, I'm always want, I always want to change something, but it doesn't look, you know, bougie enough for me. But it's still cute. It's still cute. Now, it took me a while to do all of this. And take it back out of the zone. I think I want to build me some more shelves because I'm not sure I like the table look. Uh, when I get the back organized, then we could go back there. But for right now, this is what it is. Um, I'm pretty satisfied with the work that I've done so far. I mean, it was a lot of work. Hours of me sleeping up here. Oh, money. I don't want to talk about the money, but, you know, um, when you put your all into something that you built from the ground up with your own blood, sweat, tears, your money, every, everything that you put into it, like, it's definitely a satisfying feeling, like, it feels pretty damn good. At the end of the day, you be like, oh my God, my bank account, what the hell? But... I mean, it feels pretty dang good. So that was it, you guys. Just wanted to give you a quick little tour. You know, I think I'm going to not think, but I am going to be uploading some more videos of y'all watching me make some soap. I've been saying this for so many years, it'll make no kind of sense. None. It doesn't make any kind of sense. But I am going to do some more videos. Making soap is therapeutic. And I can definitely say I love what I do. It's one of my sample packs. I used to make them different, but. I think I'm satisfied with how these look. And then on the back, it has some soap on there, but you know, that's gonna get cleaned off. Yeah, I'm gonna make some more videos for y'all. Alrighty.